Mayor Bowser came here to the Adams Morgan neighborhood roughly six hours ago to discuss crime with the community, all amidst the backdrop of the criminal revised criminal code being withdrawn before it could be voted on by the Senate. Crime's a big topic in D.C.'s Adams Morgan neighborhood. Police data shows it's up year-to-date 37 percent. That's why D.C. Mayor Muriel Bowser spent part of her day speaking to locals about the issue. Good afternoon, everybody. She revealed the neighborhood would soon get more attention from D.C.'s multi-agency nightlife task force, which has already reduced crime in DuPont Circle and 8th Street Northeast. The amount of violent crime remains very unsettling to neighbors. On the minds of many here too, DC's revised criminal code. It's how the district legally handles crimes committed locally. The council just rewrote it for the first time in more than a century, but some locals didn't like the end result. Our ridiculous council people, and I say that, are not paying attention to what the neighborhoods are saying. The president, Mayor Bowser, congressional Republicans were just a few of the other opponents to the council's measure. That's why Council Chair Phil Mendelson said he wrote Vice President Kamala Harris a letter today to withdraw the measure from Capitol Hill before the Senate could vote on it. The messaging got out of our control and that uh, the messaging got picked up by Republicans who wanted to make a campaign out of it for next year. He said the council needs to reassess the legislation and figure out ways to better convey to the public what it will actually do. Mendelssohn added he doesn't think it will be transmitted back to Congress anytime soon. That news seemed to please the mayor. I would agree with the chairman's kind of sentiment that it is best for everybody if the vote doesn't take place. Meanwhile, MPD Chief Robert Conti said whatever happens, sentencing for violent offenders must be kept tough. We really want to see homicides go down is keep bad guys with guns in jail. With the very latest from Adams Morgan, John Henry W. USA 9.